Hi, I'm Matthew Peasy. We're going to talk about how you can morph shapes inside of After Effects. There can be lots of reasons as to why you'd want to morph shapes, maybe for a titling sequence or for working with masks. To start this off, we're going to create a new composition. In terms of the dimensions and the duration, that's completely up to you. Inside the new composition dialog box, go ahead and set up your parameters and click OK. Once you click OK, we need to create a new solid. The best way to do that is to use a keyboard shortcut. It's Command Y on the Mac, Control Y on Windows. Once you hit that keyboard shortcut, a dialog box will open where you can name your solid and set up any parameters. In my case, I'm going to leave it set to this blue that I currently have selected. I'll go ahead and click OK, and the solid's been added to the composition. Now what you can do is come up towards the top and choose one of your drawing tools. You'll notice that there's several different shapes that you can choose from. In this case, I'm going to go ahead and select a star, and I'm going to draw a star out here onto the composition. After drawing the star, I'll go ahead and center it onto the composition. With the solid layer still selected, come back up and choose a different shape drawing tool. In this case, I'm going to choose the ellipse tool. With the ellipse tool, I'm going to go ahead and draw out a circle. After drawing the circle, what we want to do is set keyframes for the mask path property for both mask 1 and mask 2. Once you set the keyframes, you want to move the time indicator. I'm going to move the time indicator to the 40 frame mark. After doing that, I'm going to come back and select the first keyframe on that first mask layer. I'm going to go ahead and cut it to the clipboard, Command X or Control X on Windows. Then you can go ahead and paste it, Command V or Control V on Windows and you'll notice that the keyframe is pasted exactly where your time indicator is. If you press the spacebar on your keyboard, you'll now see that we have an animation of a star morphing into a circle. As you can see, it's very easy to create morphing shape tweens inside of After Effects.